<laughs> the tenant and her husband. Yeah, yeah. Chief. Morgan, what is going on here? Uh, I, I am... I'm confused myself. I mean, I brought my staff here to come check this property and I'm hearing her husband is here. I'm not happy about this. The house is no longer available. Chief. Uh, uh, chief. 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 Mr. Morgan, what's the meaning of all of this? M Mr. Morgan, I, I don't understand myself. He told me to come with a man when I told him I wasn't married. I did not know he wanted to do this. But that man is my father-in-law. Sorry. Uh, Mr. Son, what is wrong with you? Uh, look, like, listen, look, what you just did is not nice at all. Like, why did you have to do this? I was only trying to get you a house. Try to do what you, this is what I told you to do. Look, I don't like this. I don't want to do was only. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, I'm so sorry. Do look, you know I... how that looks? I know how crazy this looks. But trust me, I had no idea I was walking into an ambush. I mean, I, I, I never knew that. This agent make these ladies lie about the marital status so they can secure the apartments. That's a lame excuse. Come on, why are you sounding like this? I mean, if only you've 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 had the experience and you've you know what it takes to secure the apartment. I'm pretty sure you you'll reason with me. But how how? Since your father owns houses and some of them are even yours. That's not the point. It is part of the point. It is. Because if only you have this experience, you reason with me and realize that it is nothing to sweat over. It, it, it's not an issue at all. What do you mean this is not really an issue? Do you know how needy my father is? Okay. I'll go see your father. Along with Isabella. I will sort this out. We'll talk about it. I'm pretty sure you would reason with me. So what will you tell my mom? <laughs> okay, your mom is one of the most understanding women I've ever She's such a darling. I'm pretty sure she would reason with me and realize that I'm innocent. It is so unfortunate that you don't even know the magnitude of what you've done. What have I done? You signed a document that you're married while I'm still wearing your engagement ring. I signed nothing. You did. I did not. You did. I mean, the agent signed and wrote my name on it. I don't know anything about it. Believe me. I mean, how many times will I tell you? Oh. Don't even touch me. I'm not about to be a second wife. No <laughs> sense. Good day, sir. Yeah. Good day, sir. Well, how are you? Uh, very well, sir. Yeah, well, how are you? Well, thank you, sir. You're welcome. Come visit us. Uh, thank you, sir. Yeah. Uh, sir, I came to clarify the mix-up of the other day, sir. Have we called this, sir? Yes, I have, sir. I have to call her because uh, I was so surprised. Sir, I swear, I had no idea that the agent planned on saying what he said. Uh, Isabella here just nearly joined our company and she needed an accommodation. I never knew that coming with her automatically meant that I stood in for, for her husband. Sir, I didn't know about it either. Like, I'm so sorry. I am really sorry about the mix-up, sir. Sir, so I truly love Alicia and I would never betray her. Mola, sir. you know I always like you. Thank you, sir. And... Uh, Things of this nature usually happen. But one thing is that I will not take it lightly with you if you hurt my daughter. I will never do that, sir. I will never hurt her, sir. Then you need to convince her yourself that you don't have a second wife. I don't, sir. I don't, sir. Well, you know how you play a love game? <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Okay, okay. That is all you need, you know? Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. Sir, I would like to take our leave now, sir. Okay, have a nice day. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. It's my pleasure, Thank you. okay. Hello? Did you call my mother? I don't like to be taken for granted. 
What do you mean by me taking for granted? I mean, I just left your father's house and we've settled everything. Are you planning to get married to my father? No, are you not saying I am lying? Where are you now? Well, I'm in your house and I'm taking everything that belongs to me. What? What's this map? Up very much. Nonsense. I think I'm joking here, babe. What is she? What's the middle of this? What's going on here? I've thought about everything and I can't get over the possibility of you having another family. I mean, what nonsense are you spinning from your mouth? What's wrong with you? I mean, why are you making me go through all this for something I'm not guilty of? Why? What exactly is the issue, Alicia? Listen, I, I'm beginning to have a feeling that this is more than the the, 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 the agent thing. <laughs> so you're trivializing what you did? I mean, what did I do? What on earth did I do? I mean, don't you live in this country? I mean, don't you understand that it's not that most landlords don't give out their, their, their houses to single women? I said they're married. And the idiot they didn't tell me any of this. I never knew. So for my findings, what they do is they, they make the single ladies lie about their marital status and that's exactly what happened. I mean, why don't you just inquire yourself and you will realize that I'm not cooking up any of this story. Well, it doesn't matter. Well, you don't. Oh, oh, what's the meaning of this? You, you, you are ending us. I think it's for the best. I just can't continue. And I've called your mother and your sister to explain things to them. So you'll find it difficult breaking the news. Alicia, a wedding is 12 weeks away. Thank God. At least we haven't spent money on money. What are you saying? What is about that? Morgan! I am not the CEO of the company that followed the staff to graduate an apartment. And I am not the same CEO that signed on the paper that is married to the same staff. You did! Alicia, Alicia, I mean, what is wrong with you? I mean, the CEO in question just helped the staff innocently. The CEO only helped the staff innocently. I mean, the CEO in question has and will never cheat on his fiance. I mean, the CEO. Never signed anything. Don't you get it? So what's wrong with you? Morgan, goodbye. What is it? Hello? Hello, Mrs. Sam Mrs. Simon. Yeah, I'm sorry I'm calling again. Have you spoken to him? Okay, what did he say? Okay, can I can I call him? Okay. Alright. Good night.
Hello? What? Hold on, I'm coming. Ah. Morning, man. <laughs> Morning. I thought we just spoke. What are you doing here? Ah, she just resigned. Who, who resigned? Isabella. What? Wait, hold on. What do you mean by she she just resigned? I just received an email this morning. And I've been trying to reach her to no avail. All lines switched off. I mean, what she has on presently is very important. Oh, goodness. Well, she felt sorry about you and Alicia. And um, she wanted to call to apologize, but I stopped her. No, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. How did she get to know about Alicia and I? I told her. Oh, goodness. Well, why now? Why? Why? How do you... I mean, it's, it's a personal matter now. Why did you have to tell her? It is also a personal matter to her as well. Because she's the reason why Alicia left you in the first place. She wanted to call you last night to find out why you rushed out of the office in the manner which you did rush out last time. But I told her not to. Because she did see you. But, but that doesn't still change anything. You could have told her anything. I mean, something else, not this. Well, I understand, but how am I supposed to know that telling her the truth will make her quit? What's the connection? Huh? Are you blaming me? I mean, this is not right. This is not right at all. So what do we do now? We outsource the job immediately. Yes. Outsource the job? Yes. I mean, do you know what that implies? I mean, that what we ought to benefit from this deal will definitely get half. Oh. Well, half is something, Morgan, isn't it? Hmm? Are we supposed to crash and burn? No, I saw, why is everything turning out like this? Why? Okay, you know what? Go ahead, fine, let's do it. Let's do it. Sure. Morgan, stop. Morgan, stop! Come on, stop! What will come over you, man? I want if you don't stop. What's the matter with you? I love her. I know. I didn't do anything wrong. I know. She means everything to me, and I've been faithful all this while. Listen, Morgan, you don't need to tell me this. I know all this. I know how loyal you are as a person. But he doesn't call for this insanity. Since these are people who move on to someone else so fast. 
Well, maybe not so fast. Well, what, what are you saying she's been teaching on me? All I'm trying to say is that this whole thing is so unbelievable and confusing to me. Now the next step should be how to get over her. I have to go for this meeting. Take care of yourself. 